Hello everyone, this is Berlin Biker, back today with an installation guide on how to install a radiator guard for a 2017 Yamaha MT-07 with ABS. Um, this part was sent to me, so I want to be completely transparent with you guys. The company that made the windscreen for this bike, um, they saw my video, they liked what I did, they liked my fans, interactions with it, all of that. So they sent me this, hoping I would do exactly the same. So, really transparent, I didn't pay for this, but I was going to need something like this on my bike anyway. So I'm gonna show you how to do it. All right, let's jump in. Okay, everybody, let's do this. Um, you need two things. You need a 3 16th Allen, and of course you need the new radiator guard. All right, so let's jump into this. I'm going to use paper towels to throw all these in. These. Come out fairly simple. I was always told I had to do a bolt to the extreme on either side, meaning screwing in or screwing out by my dad. Basically hopes nothing will crack or anything like that, a little more even distribution of pressure between the screws. Right? Right. Okay. So I think this entire piece is just gonna come straight off and the screws don't actually even have to come off. Let's see. Perfect. I'll keep the screws just how they are, right there. Let's draw, jump to the other side. Okay, same idea. This is off. Hold and screw in. The same thing at the bottom. Cool. That comes off single piece. These screws underneath. They want to fall out if you don't want to hold them in. Now let's grab the radiator guard. Now there's a bottom on this one. It says MTO7, so I'm assuming that that would be the bottom. Um, let's throw this over, and I honestly think it's going to be this easy. Yeah. See that? You just place it there. There's no cutting. There's nothing like that needed. Radiator guard on. Let's throw this back in. Radiator guard goes there. MTS 7 down at the bottom. This screw, this cap goes back up. Um, I just stopped the video to review it again. I just wanted to make sure that the big piece did indeed go up top. Now, can I hand tighten this enough without the help of someone? Not really. Okay. Don't do what I did. If you're going to do this, grab someone else to help. Because it's not as simple as I expected it to be. I just need more hands. Okay, so that's in. No. Okay, so I'm having a really hard time doing this because it keeps falling and I don't have an extra pair of hands. So, my idea is this. I'm going to put one of these through, just the base of it, to hold it still. Then, now, I'm just going to tighten that enough, just enough, that I don't have to hold it or worry about it. Now, I'm going to jump to the other side. And with this being held, I'm going to do this. Now, I don't have to worry about it as much. It should be easier. There we go. So now the top one's already there.
Look at that. My idea worked. Now, I'm gonna jump back to the other side and do it. Since that main screw's already there, I'm gonna have to take that out, which is fine, and put it back through the proper way. Same idea. Just do one screw at a time. Let's do the top one. Line that up. Push it through. Tight. See the bottom one, and then tighten them both together. Do the same for the other side, just tighten it up. And with that, you have an all new radiator guard for your 2017 MT-07. Hey everyone, thank you for watching me install the radiator guard for my 2017 Yamaha MT-07. Um, this is the part three of four. I'm gonna wait for this airplane to go over us. It's still going, it's still loud, hopefully it's gone soon. And I think we're good to go. Cool. So this is part three of four. Um, a few days ago we did the reservoir lid for the back brake. We did the reservoir for the front brake. Today we did the radiator guard and in the next few days we are going to do the Lazy Susan which basically attaches to the kickstand giving it more contact area with the ground. If you guys like these videos and are interested and just like me, if you really like me that'd be great. Uh, make sure you hit that subscribe button. That way, whenever I produce more videos, it gets into your stream. If you like any of the parts that I've shown so far in these video series, hit that affiliate link below my uh, below this video. Buy it through there, support the channel a bit. That would be wonderful. Um, if I haven't mentioned it already, this was sent to me, the radiator guard and all these other parts were sent to me by the same company that created this aluminum windscreen. Um, they were testing some products, asking if I would be interested in receiving them for free in hopes that I would create videos for all of you. Of course, I said no, so technically I am being paid for this video, but I was looking for some cheap, easy ways to up the cool factor on my MT-07 anyway, so it all works out anyway. All right, guys, hit that subscribe button and let's keep riding. All right. It's a weird catchphrase. Let's keep writing. It's weird. It sounds cool, but in reality, there's probably like 200 other motovloggers who say the same shit.